show on the volume. I'm sure I'm sure, I'm sure I do a dual commentary, man. So my brother just watching some Yu-Gi-Oh 5Ds in the background. You know, I think like 5D is honestly one of the best series. Like that's honestly one of my favorite series, other than from the original. 5Ds is I'll give you my second favorite. So sick. Like we're watching the episode where um what is it called? When Yugi versus no, when you say versus what's the what's the guy's name? Primo, is it Primo? So what's up? What's what's wrong with saying you're watching Yu-Gi-Oh? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Shut up. My brother's so gay. I'm posting this video. Did I say your name? So it shouldn't matter. Yu-Gi-Oh guy being cocky. Oh my gosh, this guy's hilarious. And my god, when you see when you start topping YCS, come hit me up. I'll I'll play you for real. This guy's funny. Like I, like personally, I know Yu-Gi-Oh guy. He's a joker. And he's a really really good player. Uh top top 32 YCS Toronto. Um if you guys want to check out his deck profile, it's in my channel. He played Mermails. Yeah. So, the Evil Swarm player will go first this time. Is he gonna have the first turn Ophion or is he not? As I'm seeing right now, it doesn't look like he has the first turn Ophion. So, this pretty sucks for him. Activate Dragon Ravine. Dragon Ravine is like a busted card in this deck. So busted. Activate another one, watch. Nope. Draws a card, sets one face down, ends his turn. He honestly needed that Ravina to go off. That was crazy. So, what is happening right now? He just needs the Ravina to go off and. This is pretty bad for him. Evil Storm player draws. He needs to get out Ophion as fast as possible or else he's gonna basically lose. Okay. Yep. He's gonna go for the Ophion. Battle phase. What if Mirror Force? No Mirror Force. So he's being the ball like a ballsy player. But sometimes players like this, when they attack. You'll get punished because thing is thing. Because Mirror Force is a card. So he went, he activates Skill Drain. Oh, he had the Twister just for the Skill Drain. That's pretty crazy. Relax. Yu Gi Oh! guy telling 240 to relax. What is his response? To the summon Ophion. Sorry, to response to the Twister. <laughs> Honestly, Skill Drain works really, really good in, uh, with dragons. You know, it doesn't really hurt them because it'll just bring out big beaters on the board. It's pretty crazy. Ophion effect will search for the pandemic, the Forbidden Lands for evil swarms. Set that. Set the course to pandemic. In your turn. Blaster, where's Blaster? Reckless Greed. Allowing him to draw two cards. Then he activates, of course, Seven Stored. Sacred Sword of Seven Stars. Drawing two more cards. Okay, upstart goblin, giving your opponent thousand, thousand life points to draw an extra card. Pretty good. Another reckless greed, huh? So much draw power. He just hopes he has the blaster. Yep. 
Yep, he, using the blasters effect. Perfect. Ooh. Ooh. That's gonna hurt. He then forbidden dress. Ophion. This is pretty crazy. XYZ Encore. Wow. XYZ Encore is too good. Rex's deck. Up. Oh, I didn't go off. Of course, getting Dragon V, and then Dragon V makes him basically win. And I'm pretty sure he has the ducks in hand, so he's gonna pitch the dragon. Putting Phalanx in the grave. Searching for a Phalanx. Or ditching a Phalanx. Oh, he's searching a Phalanx. He has a Tempest in hand. Yep. Allow him to search a dragon. Missile 10. We're just gonna go for the OTK. Activate its effect. Effect is fine. And this is when he basically pretty much just goes off with Dragonities. Um, yeah. Let's see this. This combo. Oh, he, oh, he does not go off. Oh yeah, sorry, he does, he does, he does. So he goes Vagiana, bring back the Phalanx, tribute the Phalanx, special summoning the Missile Tin from hand. Yada yada yada, goes on and on and on. That trench will be really, really good right now. Maxi. Start as dragon. Ah, oh, it's under Maxi. I honestly didn't understand why he didn't do the thing first. Man, he didn't uh, maxi from the beginning, so he can, so he he could have drawn more cards. So yeah, he honestly should have. Yeah, he was right. He should have honestly. MSC the Marine as soon as he activated. Uh, I don't know why. Ho! Oh uh ho! -huh. This thing! So, what's gonna happen now? Does an evil swarm player have an out to a starter's dragon, or does he not? It's pretty crazy. Yeah, he shouldn't negate it with starters. He still he still had the ability to negate from the MST. I don't know why he didn't do it. Oh he had if he had skill drain, uh if if it were me, like I don't care. But skill drain just destroys evil swarms. There was no need. Kirkion anywhere? No Kirkion.
yeah, you 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 Yu Gi Oh guy basically wins from now on because uh, Dragon Ravine is a dumbass card. You draw and you pitch. That's how the deck works. Draw pitch. Draw pitch. So he's going to start banishing and of course summoning more dragons on the field then of course going to be attacking for game. So yeah. Okay. Dragon rulers. Sorry, Tempest Dragoonies. Or Dragoonie rulers. Versus of course, Evil Swarms. Wow. Of course he's going to keep Tempest on the board. Doesn't matter, he's just going to... He has game. He's gonna choose wind. So I couldn't be choosing wind. What just happened? Had no idea why uh Yu-Gi-Oh guy didn't summon another thing now, Turkey on. Ah, uh, so the Kirkion, Matagora to Ophion. Ophion is a good card. Effect? Such so, you know, the infestation trap card infestation infection set one face down so of course it'll be an infection So you activate to read. You just have a store search the ducks. Summon the ducks. Response. Crazy. 